it's your boy Duke King with another hot topic. So we're gonna go straight into it. So get get what? Watch that one here. So I basically I just got to work. Um, I'm not trying to be unprofessional. I'm upset. I just quit my job. I clocked in, found out that I'm being sent to a corona floor when they know that I have kids at home who I can't send away for you know, to stay away from me. My manager sent me to a floor that is being tested for Corona. She knows my health history. She knows all of this. I quit. I care about the patients and all, but my family and my, my life, they matter. They come first. Lavika Stewart is evil. She's evil. She knows my health history. I told her my kids don't have anybody to go to while they're here. I can't send my kids away like everybody else. I'm done. I'm leaving. My life matters and my kids matter. Screw this. You know what I would love? I would love to see the supervisor put herself in the nurse's shoes. I'd love to see that. And see her reaction. I would love to see her reaction as to she being put in that position or in that seat that she's giving the nurse because that is total wickedness you know she mo it have to be that she relate that on the um, application form so she's gonna sign up for, for, for certain things she had to relate um, what they become medical right in the medical field i think that is what they always do right they actually feel trouble with this and that and rate it you understand so i don't see how she or the supervisor at the end of the day they go place her right in a, that situation knowing to the fact that she she told her that she have a medical problem so for example if she have asthma right and I know she's not thinking about her kids first. She's thinking about her health first. You understand? And in that situation, you can see we are in. She's saying that. She told her. And she know. She, the supervisor, know. Right? So she have asthma. She can't work with on a, on a floor like that. On a floor like that. Because definitely she's gonna get sick. And if her, that type of disease, you know that it has to do with her breathing problem, right? And you know how people with asthma go about. It's not a nice thing. You understand? And if she tell her her supervisor all of that and she wanna put I would quit too. Come my health come first. Not necessarily that I'm neglecting my, my, my job. It's not that I'm neglecting my job because if you know that I have this problem and you are putting me in that position, I'm going to quit. I am going to quit. I'm not going to stay with you. And some, some supervisor, they're just like that. They're, they're so wicked. They remind me of David. David in the Bible I'm talking about. They're that wicked. A lot of Christians turn eyes on me now like, hey, what they're talking about. Who remember when David put Uriah in front of the battle? Because David want Uriah a wife. Mm hmm mm hmm Yep. That was damn wicked. And I saw some supervisors there. Wicked. You understand? They know they know the, 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 the condition. But yes, let me tell you, say, hey. I'm the supervisor. I'm the one giving you the instruction. So you got to do it or else. You know what the or else mean. I'm going to fire you or you're going to be fired. You understand? So some people stay. You know? But anyway, it's your boy Duking Entertainment Channel. So subscribe and hit the, not the notification bell for more notification. Right? And also hit the like button. Thumbs up on it. You know? Thumbs up on the videos. Give thanks. We're always here. We're always doing it. Okay, catch a boy in another video, okay? Cool.